Bob the Spider Hunter here. Gonna see if we can maybe find a male wolf spider. But the chances of that, they're pretty slim indeed. But uh, who knows, we'll have a good time here. I am out at the Ottawa County Parks Hemlock Crossing. And uh, just looking for some fun out here in today's nature. Gonna be a warm one today, probably gonna get up to about, oh, I don't know, high 70s, maybe 80, who knows. But we're heading off into the woods. I have a friend of mine here. Uh, David is with me, and uh, he's also a guy who loves nature. And matter of fact, I'll, at the end of this video, I will put a little uh, uh, way to get to his website. You can see some of his great shots he has there. All right, let's go on and see what we can find in the woods today. Hey, we already got a little spider here. Nice big orb web stretching across the whole walk area. Let's see if we can get close here to get a better shot of him. These guys like to make little jerking motions when you approach them to kind of say, back off, leave me alone. So, first find of the day, just a juvenile with a huge web. They'll be maturing as the uh, summer goes on. And there he goes. <laughs> Off into the distance. Like I said, a huge web. Hey, here's a little spider. He's made his uh, home inside of a log that's down on the ground. Oh, and I'm spooking him out. They like to hang upside down in their webs. This particular kind anyway. They are small, so it's hard to get a good shot of them. Looks like a female. Okay. See what else we can find. Hey, here's a nice little find. This is what's known as an orchard spider. Small, but uh, very pretty coloration. This one's greenish color. And it just dropped out of its web down here. Let's see if we can get it. There we go. Dropped off my hand. Even though this one is um, green on its legs and its abdomen, if I get a little closer to the abdomen area, you might see some special colorization there. Let's see if I can get closer yet. I think it's right about here on the ground.
right there. Well, you can see a little bit of the back coloration on the abdomen. Now, if we had a little sunlight, there's a little yellow reddish dot to it that's on the side, but we're not getting the proper angle shot for that. But hey, nice little spider. All right, let's try to get her back in her web. There you go. All right, let's see what else we can find. Well, here's a great find. David pointed this guy out to me. It's a jumping spider here on the uh, post. These are the guys that normally like to climb and hide on the bark of trees because of their great coloration and camouflage. And it's already checking out my camera. So we'll see if we can zoom in and get a nice little shot of his face because these guys are so cute. He's right in the center of the screen there. And his little pedipalps are all furry. So let's see if we get him interested in looking at us here. He's not too interested right now, that's for sure. Isn't he just a little cutie? Hey, we got a couple deer here off the path, right through there. See them? Sorry it's shaky, I don't have a tripod with me. But he's checking us out. There he goes. Yeah, I think we got a, maybe a salamander here. Dave, you want to move that log over a little bit? Okay, he was right here. I saw him. There he is. There he is. Hey, buddy. Cool. Nice little guy. Is he a black one or a red? Um, you tell me, you're the salamander expert. I'm a glass. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, we're getting old. <laughs> oh, he's black. He's the black one. He has a chubby tail. Oh, yeah. There he is. He's in a hurry to get back down. I know. All right, all right, we'll put you down, we'll put you down. I'm going to put it on the side of the log because I'm afraid it might gush him when I oh. go back. Oh, I'm okay. He can find his way back. This is the bull and doily web spider. And what they do is their um, web is a kind of a curved or bowl shaped. And then the doily section under the bowl, you might be able to see it. There's a more of a horizontal webbing under that. And uh, that's where the spider sits underneath the actual bowl shaped uh, upside down waiting for something to fall into or climb into the actual bowl part of the webbing. And uh, when something does go into there, then they go into attack mode, bite right through the webbing and uh, grab their prey and pull them through the web. I don't want to wreck its little web. <laughs> anyway, that's the bull and doily spider. That gives a whole new meaning to you got mail? <laughs> Now I realize this isn't all that spectacular when it comes to spiders, but this is a little um, uh, a, a spider that makes his web like a bowl, and it's called a. Uh, it's called <laughs> what the heck's it called? It's called a bowl web spider. <laughs> uh, there's a retake on that one. <laughs>